The Italian army has embarked on a modernization project for its FH-70 155mm towed howitzers, a key component of its long-range arsenal. This program is part of two separate contracts awarded to Italian companies Aris SRL and Leonardo UK, totaling over 21.8 million euros. These contracts aim to improve the FH-70 and other systems currently in service, with Leonardo UK receiving 15.7 million euros and Aris SRL 6.1 million euros. This initiative follows the war in Ukraine, which highlighted the importance of artillery in modern combat and led to a re-evaluation of the role of artillery by several European countries. The Italian army currently has 160 FH-70 155mm howitzers, first introduced into service in 1978. The modernization aims to replace worn parts and reduce obsolescence issues with these systems, which have been in service for over four decades. Additionally, this initiative is part of a context where several European countries, including Spain, are looking to strengthen their 155mm ammunition stocks. The FH-70, a product of collaboration between Germany, the United Kingdom, and Italy, represents a milestone in the development of towed artillery. Designed to meet NATO criteria from the 1970s, this howitzer is equipped with remarkable features, making it suitable for the challenges of modern battlefields. Equipped with a 155mm, 39 caliber barrel, the FH-70 is distinguished by its double baffle muzzle brake and sliding breech block. These features grant the weapon exceptional precision and firepower. Its range is also notable, reaching 24.7 km with standard NATO ammunition, and extending up to 30 km with extended range projectiles. Its firing capacity is impressive, with the ability to launch three shells in just 15 seconds. The FH-70 can maintain a rapid-fire rate of 6 shells per minute and a sustained rate of 2 shells per minute, a performance that underscores its responsiveness and efficiency in combat situations. Another aspect of the FH-70 is its Detachable Auxiliary Power Unit, APU. This equipment provides it with autonomous mobility, allowing it to move at speeds of up to 20 km per hour, although it is usually towed by a truck. While the FH-70 does not have a protective shield for the crew, which normally consists of eight men, it is designed to be efficiently operated by a reduced group of at least four people. These attributes give the FH-70 great versatility and remarkable efficiency in the field, making it particularly suited to the demands of modern battlefields. Italy's decision to modernize these howitzers underscores the growing importance of artillery in current defense strategies particularly in the context of recent conflicts and evolving military tactics. Furthermore, Italy's decision to modernize its FH-70S is part of a broader trend observed in Europe, where several nations are reconsidering their approach to artillery in the face of challenges posed by current conflicts. This includes not only the modernization of existing equipment but also the acquisition of new artillery systems and the updating of ammunition stocks. This evolution of artillery, its role, and capabilities is a direct response to the lessons learned from recent conflicts where artillery has played a crucial role. The FH-70, with its rapid-firing capability, extended range, and autonomous mobility, exemplifies the transformation of artillery systems to meet the demands of modern warfare. The modernization of the FH-70S will also help to extend the operational life of these systems, ensuring that the Italian army has an effective tool to support its operations in the coming years. This initiative reflects the understanding that, despite the rapid evolution of military technology, traditional weapon systems like towed artillery remain essential components of battlefield firepower.